right, so boom. I just got out of the shower. Oh my gosh, it feels so good to take a shower. Whew. I had to take my time. You see, I'm out of breath. I took my bandages off, well, the first layer. Um, now all I have is like the second layer on and she said that they should fall off on their own. My stomach is still pretty a little, pretty a little, pretty swollen a little. Um, yeah. I have this, the belly binder thing that I'm gonna wrap around my belly when I need to get up and walk and stuff because it makes it easier for me to walk around and up and down the stairs. I just, not just, but I did walk down the stairs today because my grandma came back from New York. So I did walk down, it took me a little bit, but I walked down the stairs and I walked back up by myself. Ooh. Now I'm about to lay down because my side is hurting. <sighs> also, my cousin came and brought me some goodies. How cute. I see a candle, chips, cookies, candy. Mm. Bonsoir. I'm out here looking naked. I'm not naked, I promise. I have a tube top on. Um, it's Saturday. Um, I just woke up from a nap. <sighs> Yeah, so I just woke up from a nap and my stomach is hurting. Um, I feel like I need to throw up. Like, you know, like when it's like right here and it won't come up. Yeah, I feel like I need to throw up. Um, I haven't taken any pills today. I'm gonna take one before I go to sleep, definitely. Um, what else? I had a patch behind my ear. They put it there before surgery. She said it was to control the nausea um, that I would have from the anesthesia. Um, so yeah, I mean, which I told you guys, I threw up the first night anyway. Oh, so much for that working. I took it off earlier because it was itching. Um, and now I'm nauseous. So, I don't know. I can't wait for this to be over. I can't wait to be fully healed. I did eat a little bit today. Um, I ate a little bit. That's it. Gotta go. Bonjour, Zamis. Um, happy Resurrection Sunday. It's Sunday. April 21st, it's 11-11, um, I'm, I'm just so grateful, I'm just so grateful to God, like, it's Sunday, I had surgery on Wednesday, so it's only been what, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, four days, four days post- up um and i'm getting around much better getting in and out of the bed 
um, much better walking around much better like I'm I'm not hunched over as much anymore um I feel more alive definitely feel more alive than I have been feeling these past few days um I just thank God for my health like the things we take for granted the things the everyday things that we take for granted my sight yo yesterday and the day before yesterday my sight like my sight was so blurry and I think I was thinking like maybe it had something to do with I don't know if I said this already but they put a patch behind my ear for the anesthesia um so that afterwards I wouldn't be as nauseous with um from the anesthesia so they put a patch behind my ear so that I can keep it there for three days but don't touch it because if I touch it and then if I touch my eyes then it could it could cause blindness or blurry vision so I'm thinking that I probably accidentally did that because it was itching um or another thing is I had read in the packet something about the oxy that one of the side effects could be like um blurry vision or something so I don't know but um, it's not like blurry, blurry to the point where like I'm freaking out, but I had put my glass, I wear glasses, I put my glasses on and it, and it was still kind of blurry and I was just like, hold on. Um, but yeah, um, what else? Um, but I'm, I'm feeling so much better, so much better. I pooped last night. I, I took a laxative yesterday around like 12 noon. Or was it 12.30? Probably 12.30 in the afternoon. I took a laxative and I was just laying there waiting for it to work. And then finally at like 7 p.m. I pooped a lot. <laughs> TMI? I don't care. Like people need to know these things. People that's going through the same things. This is why I'm making this, these videos because I couldn't find videos like this. And I want... Other people who are about to get the surgery or going through the same thing that I was going through to know what they're getting themselves into. So, I finally pooped. I haven't pooped since the Tuesday before my surgery. And I finally pooped yesterday, Saturday, um, because of the laxatives. And my friend had brought me some prune juice. So, I took the laxatives with the prune juice. And I was drinking the prune juice, too. So I finally pooped yesterday, last night, seven. And then I this morning I woke up, pooped again. So I'm doing good. Um, I just thank God for a speedy recovery. And um yeah, something I wanted to highlight is somebody asked me in my comments about the anesthesia. And um, if I can talk more about the anesthesia process, honestly, I, I do not remember anything about that. I remember the anesthesiologist coming in and I recorded, my dad recorded that part. The guy came in and talked to me about the anesthesia. I had cut off most of the conversation, but he had me sign some paperwork. And um, basically with that, he, I had, I already had the IV and so what, um, they did was they came in right before surgery and um, put the the um, I remember her putting the anesthesia drip into my IV the IV that I already had um, so the first IV that they gave me was just fluid to keep myself hydrated because I haven't drank anything so um, so they the fluids were keeping me hydrated and they switched out that and they changed the bag to the anesthesia one. And then after that, honestly, I don't remember anything. And what else did you ask me? Um, what does it feel like? So it just, I don't, honestly, I just, I wish I could, I wish I could answer that for you. Literally, and you ask if you could fight it. <laughs> you can't fight it. You cannot fight it. Literally, it was just like, I was up. And then I was out and then I was up again in the recovery room. And I was just like, one thing I do remember, I do remember a moment in the operating room when I was going in and my doctor was like, okay, it's just all us women in here. 
you're safe. And um, I remember seeing the robot and I think I was like, is that the robot or something? I don't know. My tongue is yellow because I drank a turmeric tea. But um, I do remember that one part in the operating room. You can't, it's like once they give it to you, you're out. You're out. You are out. And then you wake up in the recovery room and it's like, wow, what happened? But um after the anesthesia, the anesthesia takes a long time to wear off. Even when I got home, I was still dizzy and stuff from the anesthesia and I was still out of it. You guys seen you seen like in the the vlog where I was recording like on my way home, like my eyes was rolling back and I was out of it. But um yeah, that anesthesia um took a while to wear off. Like that whole night I was like drunk. <laughs> basically and um some people do get sick from the anesthesia like na um nauseous and stuff that's why they give you the patch behind your ear um but I even with the patch I still threw up I don't I don't know maybe it was the peanut butter and jelly sandwich that I ate I don't know but anyways um so yeah it's like do you get sleepy or is it more like wide awake to instantly out I think it's it's different for everybody, but for me, it was like, I was up, and then I started drifting. Oh, my hand is shaking. I started drifting, I started drifting, I started drifting, and then I was out. Like, I couldn't fight it. I could not fight it at all. Um, yeah. But don't be scared about the anesthesia. Don't be scared about getting put to sleep. I have... Um, had anesthesia before when I got my wisdom teeth out I got all of my wisdom teeth out at the same time so they put me to sleep for that and that anesthesia was nothing like this anesthesia I I don't think it was as strong but I mean for that I was out and then I was up um but for this anesthesia it lasted a longer time like a it took a while to wear off Fully. But don't be scared about getting put to sleep because um, you'll be all right. You will be all right. I'm all right. I made it through it. You can make it through it too. So <sighs> today is Resurrection Sunday. I'm in the bed. I'm so sad that I'm missing church, but I'm going to watch online somebody's. I'm going to watch somebody's church online. I don't know who yet, but I'm watching somebody's church. Hi, All Nations Atlanta. I'm about to watch them online. Alright, guys. That's it. So I'll see you guys later.